All right, for the middle of the week, we got a strength workout focusing on our glutes and core. And remember, after this workout at seven o'clock on Wednesday nights, we have yoga. So if you wanna to come to the sixth and stay for yoga, or just come in and get some mobility, some good stretching, it'll really help complement all the hard work you're doing during the week. Make sure you register. So we're gonna start this workout off with 10 banded good mornings. This is a great opportunity to grab a yellow or a purple band. This is one of the strongest patterns, so there's a great opportunity to maybe upgrade your band from the red. And then five toes to rig or toes to bar, whatever we feel most comfortable with. Remember, we wanna be pushing up on the bar as we pull our, our toes back or our knees back because we're engaging the lats and the abdominals together because we need those lats when we deadlift and we need a tight core to stabilize our body. Then we're gonna go three sets of five touch and go deadlift. This is where we're just touching the ground, catching it off the bounce almost. We wanna explode up nice and high, pushing down the floor, building nice explosive hinging pattern for the deadlift. Then we're gonna get on to five sets. We're gonna do reps of four. Last week it was six, now we're down to four. So we wanna push the weight a little bit heavier. We're gonna do one second down, one second pause on the bottom, so not touch and go. We wanna make each and every rep from a dead stop. We're gonna pair that with 15 biggie smalls. These are always a challenge, these always hit the core so great. We're gonna stretch right out on the ground, tuck the knees in. If we can hold a 10 pound, 15, 20, 35 pound plate, we wanna add a little bit of weight here too. After we go through those five sets, then we've got five sets on four minutes. A little bit of pacing, a little bit of aerobic a little, and recovery. Two to three wall walks. We saw these for the first time a couple weeks ago. A lot of people had a lot of fun with them. And remember, we got lots of scaling options if you're not comfortable going upside down. We also have ways to slowly get you upside down if that's where we want to do. We're going to pair those with 10 T-Rex rows, 20 alternating jumping lunges, then we're gonna go back down the other side. Ideally, we'll get this done in three minutes or less, so you have a minute of rest and recovery before we go on to the next set. Hold through five sets, nice continuous movement. All right, well, it's gonna be a great workout for a Wednesday, and hopefully we see some of you at yoga later.